everybody welcome back again to my channel it's a nice evening and so we're gonna cook meatball and spaghetti right here I have my organic meat my chopped meat and uh, I'm trying to eat healthy so I have organic and now I have my whole wheat spaghetti I have some salt salt I have my onion which I'm gonna grate and I have my garlic this is a good garlic thing I show you look if you have something like this you just squeeze the garlic and it come right out and you can take your brush and get everything out I'm gonna put two eggs some Italian seasoning I have my black pepper I don't like black pepper that much I'm gonna put a little bit in here because it's meatball you know and then I have my garlic powder my onion powder don't forget your salt I have a little bread crumbs here like a half a cup it depends on how much meat then you will know how much bread crumbs and I have a good amount of meat here so I'm putting like I'm putting like a half a cup if I need any more depends on the texture of the meat it's when I'm finished to roll it in a ball then I will know if I need more 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 breadcrumbs mm -hmm. this is where everything gets mixed in with all the seasoning this is where everything gets mixed in with all the seasoning This is where everything gets mixed in with all the seasoning. Hello, so we're here. We're going to put the sauce on. This is a quick and easy way so you can make your, your meatballs. And then I'm going to cover with some foil paper foil paper here and then I'm going to put it in the oven for in the oven at degrees 350 degrees and after I'm going to take it out turn it over and put it back so we can cook some more and after I take off the paper, the foil paper all together and let it brown. How pretty they look. I'm gonna so I'm gonna put on my fire paper. So what you can do also is take like a quarter bottle of water and wash out your bottle and just throw it over you to make more sauce. Have enough liquid and this one you can do the same. I'm gonna combine them after a while but I just want to spread them out to bake them properly. And I'm going to cover now with my foil. And put them in the oven for about an hour. It will take about an hour to cook. And yeah, I told you before I'm going to turn them over. And cover again and then brown. Take off the cup and burn brown in the end. Mm -hmm. 
thing here how the meatball is going it's cooking down it's looking pretty you know I am um, I combine them because you know it's shrink a little bit so I combine them and into one container and now it's cooking down it's look, looks so pretty